Three new portraits of Kate Middleton have been released to mark the Duchess of Cambridge's 40th birthday. And now a royal TikTok influencer, at Mata underscore of underscore fact, has weighed in on what she thinks the three photographs represent. Explaining that there seems to be an evolution in the images, Amanda's theory is that the portraits reflect the past, present and future of the monarchy. I think these portraits are meant to represent the royal family's vision of their own past, present and future, she confessed. The TikTok star suggested the tintype color scheme used in the first portrait of Kate Middleton draws comparisons to a 1950s portrait of Princess Margaret and a portrait of Queen Victoria. We've seen them try to connect Kate to royal women of the past, namely Princess Diana, the engagement ring, but this is the first time we've really seen them go past monarchs and past rulers and it's very much giving regal, timeless, classically beautiful and elegant but also powerful. Moving on to the second portrait in which Kate is much closer to the camera and beaming with her hair loose over her shoulders, TikTok's Amanda is convinced this is a nod to the 80s. A lot of you guys were saying 80s glamour shot, which I absolutely agree with. It's soft focus, you have the waves in the hair and you have the one-shoulder dress. Again, it's very much of Princess Diana's time. However, the royal watcher went on to remind fans that Kate was born in the 1980s and could be paying homage to the era for that reason. I think this one is a tie-in to Diana and her own upbringing. It's a bit fun, it's a bit playful but it's also very visually comfortable and visually what we've seen before. Therefore, the present. Which brings Amanda onto the final portrait. And noticeably, the only one in color, to highlight the Duchess' gorgeous red gown. Highlighting the risks taken in this third and final portrait, the TikTok star explained, off the shoulder and a hand in the pocket? What will the critics say? She added, if we're going with this interpretation, then this is the future of the monarchy that the royal family wants us to envision. The past two pictures, Kate was wearing Princess Diana's pearl earrings, but in this one she is wearing Queen Elizabeth's diamond earrings. Despite the fact Kate Middleton will not be queen until Prince Charles' reign is over, there is something to be said for Amanda's theory. This is a through line being drawn from Queen Elizabeth II to Catherine, the Duchess of Cambridge. It is also a more sophisticated, more polished version of Kate than we've gotten in a long time. It's certainly an interesting theory. However, Kate Middleton's glam birthday photographs have been dubbed as Hollywood and airbrushed by royal fans, who have also made comparisons to Meghan Markle. The Duchess of Cambridge released three portraits yesterday to mark her 40th birthday today, January 9. In the snaps Kate can be seen sporting different Alexander McQueen dresses as well as jewelry belonging to both the Queen and Princess Diana. Kate and Prince William's official Twitter account wrote, Delighted to share a new portrait of the Duchess ahead of her 40th birthday tomorrow. This is one of three new portraits which will enter the permanent collection of the Edinburgh London, of which the Duchess is patron. Although many royal fans gushed over the stunning and ethereal snaps, others on Twitter were less enthusiastic. Super Hollywood glam, wrote one person, before adding, these don't even look like Kate. Another person chimed, not sure if I really like these all that much. Looks a little too airbrushed for my taste. A third said, Seriously not the best photos I've ever seen of her. Something very weird about them. If Meg had done this on her 40th, she would have been torn to shreds, wrote someone else. Celebrated fashion photographer Paolo Riversi, who worked with Kate on these snaps, described photographing the Duchess as a moment of pure joy. He said, taking the portrait of Her Royal Highness the Duchess of Cambridge was a true honor for me and a moment of pure joy. I was moved by her warmth and friendly welcome and enchanted by her shining eyes that reflected the loveliness of her soul and her smile showing the generosity of her heart. It was a profound and rich experience for me, an unforgettable moment. I have met a wonderful person, a person who, with her positive energy, can bring hope to the whole world.